Good morning guys. Today is Sunday. It is 10.40 in the morning. <clears throat> Me and Emma slept in a little bit today so I'm making my coffee kind of late. But um, yeah today's Sunday. I know I haven't vlogged in a while but we've been really busy with like birthday parties and doing stuff on the weekends when Leon's off for work which I should probably have vlogged because they were like fun vlogs where we went swimming and Chuck E. Cheese in the park and stuff but I just haven't been in the mood to vlog lately so I'm hoping I can get out of that. I still need to do like Emma's <coughs> school supply shopping and her back to school shopping which hopefully I'm doing this week so I'll also have videos for you guys of her clothing, fall clothing haul and back to school supply haul. I just am totally waiting till the last minute this year and I tried to look for our backpacks at Target and Walmart last week and they didn't have any that she liked so <clears throat> I don't know what we're gonna do about that. I might try to order one on Amazon or something. I don't know but Today I'm going to go through Emma's toys, which I do like every three or four months. I actually have an update on Emma's asthma. We went to go see a pulmonary specialist and um, <clears throat> they also did an allergy test where they poke her back, which was not pleasant for her or for us to watch. But um, the only thing that came back she's allergic to is dust mites. So we've been vacuuming and dusting a lot, and the stuffed animals in her room, the specialist said, are like the worst, even if you clean them, because they just attract all the dust mites. So we're going to get rid of some of her stuffed animals. She has a whole tub full of stuffed animals, and just her toys are, when she gets out all of her toys, she'll put them back where they go, but it's not in like the bins nicely, so it just looks really messy. So that's what we're going to do today, and then I have... Emma's clothes in the dryer from like three, day, three days ago that I need to fold and don't judge me guys because I know you guys do that too sometimes so I need to do that and it's almost 11 we slept in till 10 Emma went to bed at 9 last night and slept until 10 when she was catching up on sleep but she's just watching um Roblox on TV which on YouTube, which is her favorite thing ever. But yeah, I'm gonna drink my coffee and then get going on what we have to do today. It's 11.40 now. It's been like an hour since I talked to you guys. And I did the dishes from breakfast. I'm almost done with my coffee. And I put the Emma's clothes back in the dryer for like 20 minutes, de wrinkle them, and then I put towels in the washer. And now I thought I would show you guys, we went to Burlington yesterday and did a little bit of shopping. And if you guys don't know, Burlington's like Marshalls and Ross. But, um, yeah, so I thought I'd show you guys what we got since I haven't put it away yet. I got this little spoon rest holder, this cute little owl that I'm going to put right here on my stove. I have one for my coffee spoon, but not my stove, and that was only $2.99. So I got that. I got Emma a fall winter pajama set. Sorry if you can hear the washer in the background. But this was actually on clearance for $4.99. And it's um, Shopkins fleece, long sleeve shirt, and pants. And it also comes with a little necklace. Back here, the little lipstick one. I thought that was super cute. And then I tried to lay this out, but... <laughs> And then I got Emma one long sleeve shirt. I'm trying to get her more long sleeves because she still has a bunch of short sleeves that fit her. And maybe like four or four to like eight long sleeves. So I got this one which is Carter's brand I believe. Yes. And it says full of love and it has flowers. And this is only $4.99. So super cheap. And then I got a couple shirts for myself. This is a black tank top that has like those straps in the front which I think are super cute and this was $5.99 kind of expensive but those ones with the straps usually are a little bit more pricier than plain ones and then I got two long sleeve shirts which it's probably kind of early for this it's still super hot not super hot but warm in Washington so it's like this black long sleeve I don't know what you call this material but 
it has like the strings in the front too so I thought that was super cute and then this is a quarter sleeve but it's black and white stripes and then it has floral sleeves which I thought was really really cute so I got that shirt and I believe this was $8.99 so not too bad I got all that stuff I'm gonna put away I'm gonna start working on Emma's room since I'm like de-wrinkling de her clothes in the dryer just in case they got wrinkly from being in there. So I'm going to start on Emma's room. She's playing with Elsa. She's probably going to notice that I'm in her room and she's going to come help me. But let me show you guys the state of her room like for and after. And I think I did this in another vlog where I was going through her toys. Let me turn the light on. It's really, really bad in her toy organizer and her stuffed animals. So, here's her castle. It's not that bad. She just has, that's the main thing she plays with, so it's always kind of messy. She has little Shopkins houses down there, and then this toy bin is just the worst right now. She has way too many Barbies. I'm going to tell her she needs to get rid of, rid of like, eight or ten, because it won't even fit in there. That whole thing is full of Barbies. That's all baby stuff, which... These babies don't even fit in there. So we need to get rid of some of that too. And that is her stuffed animal pile. She has this huge pillow pet. And then all those stuffed animals. So we're going to get rid of some of those and clean up. Her closet isn't bad at all. I just need to pick up her shoes. When she comes and picks her shoes, then it looks like this. And then her closet. I still need to get rid of blankets, but some of them are sentimental so I don't and then we'll clean up her kitchen a little bit and maybe make her bed I've said this before but I'm definitely not one of those moms or people that make their bed every day or their kids bed I think I'm gonna when she starts first grade make her a tour chart which I probably should have already done I don't know but <laughs> of her like making her bed she can cleans up her toys and everything but yeah, I have like a tiny bit of coffee left. I'm going to chug this and then put some music on my phone, some Pandora, and get to cleaning. By the way, I went to two concerts recently. Hold on, sweetie. And um, you guys need to follow me on Snapchat if you don't because when I'm not vlogging, I'm always on Snapchat. So it's always linked down below. I went to the Kendrick Lamar concert with my friends, and then Leon took me to the Metallica event sevenfold. I know those are two totally different genres of music, but I like both. So it was really fun. And I was going to yeah. vlog it, but I didn't want to do it and then get copyrighted. So watch my Snapchat. Emma and Elsa are down here. She, This is her favorite spot, is to look out the window. And that's where she sleeps a lot too, because it's cooler. Elsa! What are you doing? What are you doing, sweetie? What are you doing? I know. Oh, yeah. I'm really hot, Kana. Oh. <laughs> Emma's still in her jammies. On Sundays, we usually don't get dressed unless we're going somewhere. Huh? Yeah. Then he's Elsa. She's standing in the window, looking in the skies. See how you be, Elsa. <laughs> Hey guys, what are you doing? He got my hair. That's cool. And to get to the snow awesome. And that is our work. And he's mommy here today. You can help. He, he's still on. He's jamming. And that's is how I see. And I'm watching. That's who is. It's so weird. We finished Emma's room. Here's the two bags and a little Peppa Pig house that we are donating. Last time we had like five bags, I think, so this is pretty good. This whole thing is stuffed animals, and this is just some random toys. So 
Her room looks a lot better. Got rid of all the clutter here. Emma made her bed and then folded some blankets, organized her books. I only got rid of one book because we read Story Store every night, so we have a lot of books. Her nightstand. I told her she could have one stuffed animal on her bed, and she picked this super cute little husky beanie boo that we got her last week that looks just like Elsa. What's her name? Um, Anna. Anna. So like Anna and Elsa? That's so cute. Hey! And then... Hey, we moved this today because... Yeah, so yeah. we moved that bin of stuffed animals in her closet, and then moved her bin yeah. of movies. She watches a movie when she goes to bed, so we have that. And then this is full of a bunch of <laughs> Leon's... Hold on, sweetie. A bunch of Leon's Hot Wheels in there. And then Emma's little cars. And the cars were over here, but I just moved her. And then we moved her big pillow pet in this little corner. Her window, which you probably can't see from the glare. We cleaned out her castle a bit, took all the clutter out, and she just did it how how she likes. Emma said she's going to show you in a minute. And then we really, really got rid of a ton of stuff in here and organized it. We got rid of a couple babies. So she has babies, blankets, and bottles. This is tiny stuffed animals. It's like a couple more Beanie Boos and stuff like that. This is dress up and jewelry. This has like slinkies, jump rope. Her Barbies still looks cool, but we got rid of like seven. I had her pick seven. So that's her Barbies. And then we really organized all her tiny stuff. So this little baggie is pets. She has Hatchimals in this thing. This is all of her freaking shop kittens. I bought her a case for Christmas to keep them in and I don't know what happened. It's all her Shopkins. This is like all her little people doll figurines. And then these are like the Ello Baby Surprise Packs and Genies and Babies. And then these right here are Shopkins dolls. So I thought it would be better to organize it. I want to find a different way to make it look nicer, but I thought they could organize it in little baggies. So oh, there's her stroller. <laughs> So it's not just all in here like a huge pile. So we're going to try keep it like that. These are like little random furniture pieces from houses. These are like her alive pets, her Hatchimal, Zoomer Kitty. And then these are her little Shopkin houses that she kept. And this is actually a Polly Pocket house that my mom found for her at Goodwill. So we have that. And then by moving her stuffed animals in here, I feel like it made her closet look so much smaller. But we cleaned up her kitchen. This is her stuffed animal bin. Cleaned up her shoes. And then this I need to find a better way to organize as well. I just have it in this little pink thing. So that just still looks messy to me. And these are some of her clothes I'm trying to get rid of on offer up. If not, I'll just donate them maybe. I don't know. And then she has blocks and stuff. And then we cleaned up her kitchen a little bit. I kind of want to get her, like, I saw the super cute kid craft ones at Costco around Christmas time, and it's, like, half the size. So I kind of want to downgrade because it takes up a lot of space. But that else is on the bed. She did. She was very bored while we were doing that. And it's, like, 1.30 now, so I'm going to make us yep, some lunch. Bed. You want to show them your castle? Yeah. I might want to show you guys her castle, how she organized it. Yeah, and here's the babies. Look at them. There's a boy and a girl. Look at this girl. <laughs> He's funny. And I don't know, I was doing in the bed. My bed. And I was getting her toy now. He got it. But I still. It's funny. We cut that off. Two, two pieces. The only one is right here next to my castle in the kitchen. And I'll get it to us. Sir. Here you go, sir. We're going to go make some lunch now. What do you want for lunch? You want a ham sandwich? Or um, just ham? Just, just, just big noodles. Oh, you want noodles? Yeah. <laughs> here is Emma's lunch. I made her some ramen noodles as requested. And I... Put some ham in here to see if she'll eat it like this for some more protein. If not, I'll just put it on the side next time. But this is just about half of the ramen noodles. The rest 
is in here. I just drain pretty much all the water. And if she's still hungry, I'll give her the rest. And then she has some sliced apples and Honest Kids fruit punch drink. And then I'm going to let her have one. I think I'm going to give her half because these are pretty huge muffins of one of the one of these muffins for dessert because we got those yesterday and she didn't have one yesterday. So I'll probably give her half of that. So I'm going to give that to her. Here is Emma's laundry that I need to fold. But before I do that, I'm going to make my lunch. And I'm going to have one of these ramen bowls I got from Costco. I didn't do my last Costco haul. I didn't film it. Um, I only got like five things. But it's these like ramen noodle frozen bowls with chicken and vegetables. And they're really, really good. So I think I'm going to make that for myself. And watch some YouTube. And then start on folding laundry. Hey guys, so it's actually the next day. It's like 8 in the morning. I didn't end up finishing a vlogging yesterday, but <clears throat> Elsa woke me up at like 7.30 today. So it's like 8.20 right now. Emma and Elsa, or Emma and Elsa. It's too early. <laughs> um, Emma and Leon are still sleeping. And I'm just sitting here with Elsa. And I'm going to start editing the vlog from yesterday so I can get it up for you guys. But I'm going to vlog tomorrow um, when I do Emma's back to school shopping. But I hope you guys enjoy. See you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Say bye. Say bye guys.